right guys welcome back to part two thanks for coming back again as you can see in front of you right now is the long awaited release of the superman motion picture anthology on blu-ray this is all five movies i've been waiting for this to come out for the longest time and i'm glad to finally have it it's a lovely box set and as you can see it's 1978 to 2006 and it's an eight disc edition it's got over 20 hours of bonus features it's just a lovely addition they could have done a better job I mean there's no booklet in it or anything like that but you know I do love my digipack box sets and I do love the colours of this box set I mean the reds and the blues are just so beautiful and as you all know I am a huge Superman fan and all of these movies especially the first one are very close to my heart and as you can see it opens up from a digi pack and you've got two discs of superman the movie then you've got two discs of superman 2 which includes the donna cut which is really really cool it's like watching the movie all over again and you've got superman 3 superman 4 the quest for peace superman returns and the bonus features disc I paid £40 for this, I've seen you can get it on play.com for 35 good deal, you know. I have a load of versions of this movie already, these movies already, but I'm really happy to finally have them on Blu-ray and I can't wait to just have a whole weekend to just watch them all. So I'm really looking forward to it. And like I said, the colours are just amazing and you've got the cape going across with the blue sky in the background, I think it just looks really sweet. It's nice, I'm happy. And as you can see there, it tells you what's on all the discs. Very nice, some nice artwork. Like I said, a booklet would have been nice. But what can you do? Can't bend them all. And like I said, I paid 40 quid for this, which I thought was, you know, I would have paid 80. <laughs> would have paid 100. But now there you go. Uh, the rest of the stuff that I'm going to be showing in this video is mainly going to be horror stuff. Although I've got five steel books to show you three awesome box sets and some digi packs so yeah what i'll do is i'll stop waffling on because we always do it and i'll move on and i'll show you the steel books okay so just bear with us okay guys as you can see the first steel book i'm showing you is another definitive edition this is of independence day i showed a load of these in my last video i nipped out yesterday in town and i couldn't believe it i found two more definitive editions these two and again you know you don't really see them in town you usually have to buy them online but the shop i go to i had this in it and it was only four pound so i snapped it up not too happy with the discs there's no artwork or anything a bit of artwork inside of the mothership and blowing up the white house you know they're all very similar these definitive editions but no when i seen this i was over the moon and for the price i paid as well happy 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 <laughs> Okay, the next one that I got was another definitive edition. And when I saw this as well, I couldn't believe it because it's now completed me aliens. And it is Alien Resurrection. I found this for a fiver. Absolutely. I was jumping for joy yesterday. <laughs> but no, really pleased. As you can see, lovely artwork on the front. And yeah, I'm well on my way now to completing my definitive editions. And once I have, I'll show you. I'll do a video totally dedicated to it, showing you them all individually. And I, like all the others, two disc edition, brilliant, buzzing. Okay, the next one that I got, or actually, my wife got me this. She found this at a car boot sale. She paid £5 for it and it is classic horror, greatest ever classic horror. And it features five movies as you can see there. Pound a movie, you can't go wrong. I have all these movies already but you know it's a steel book, what can you do? We've all got that steel book addiction haven't we? <laughs> and as you can see there's the five movies inside. Very nice, very happy to have it and I think I've got a good wife you know. <laughs> she, uh, she supports me addiction. <laughs> Right, so that's classic horror. The next one I got was an absolute bargain and another great find because you don't see this too often. And it was a steelbook of Apocalypto, DVD steelbook. I paid three pound for this and I couldn't believe it, but then I took it to the counter and then I realized why. It only features 
one disc so it should be two discs but one of the discs is missing you know but what I'll do is I'll buy a normal definitive edition in a slip case and I'll just take the discs from that and I'll put them in this so you know I'm really really pleased absolutely brilliant you don't see many of these around and like I said for three pound I think it was my lucky day yesterday it was definitely worth a trip into town so there you go Apocalypto brilliant film brilliant film and the last steel book I got was another great find and it was Die Hard 4.0 the ultimate action edition lovely steel book not a huge fan of the movie I thought it was okay but you know again it's a steel book so you've just got to click at it haven't you and I think I paid a fiver for this so happy days lovely artwork police car into the helicopter John McLean two disc edition very nice so yeah I wasn't expecting to show you any more steel books but there you go guys who's a lucky lad <laughs> right what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna move on to some digi packs and a couple of DVDs and then last of all I'm gonna show you three fantastic horror box sets that I've got so if you just bear with us we'll move on nice one guys yay okay guys the next four that i'm going to show you are my four releases of the after dark originals horror movies there's going to be eight in all but these are the first and only four that have been released at the moment i think they've been releasing two a month and the order that you see here is the order that they were released and these are cracking little horror movies and i'd highly recommend picking them up and you can pick them up pretty cheap now i think five to seven pound and they're definitely if you're a horror fan you must invest in these and just have them in the collection in the horror collection i think originally they were after dark horror fest and they've been releasing eight titles for a few years now but it was only in america and for us they were quite hard to get hold of but now it's great that they finally come over to the uk and they're releasing these for us over here fantastic if you want to know more about these you can visit the after dark website just go onto Google and just type it in and you'll see all of these After Dark original releases. Fantastic. Like I said, I must have for the horror collection, they're cracking little movies. And us collectors, we love seeing them on the shelves. So as you can see, with the eight together, I think they look pretty sweet. So yeah, definitely invest in these if you're a horror fan. Okay. All right, guys, I'm going to move on to some more now, so just bear with us. Okay guys, as you can see, next thing I'm showing you is The Walking Dead. This is the DVD release that was released recently, the six episode pilot. They're in the middle of making season two now, which I think is going to be nine or twelve episodes, which is fantastic. I love this. I held out from watching it from TV because I like to watch them all together. I love this show, can't highly recommend it enough. And also, you can see five volumes of the graphic novel The Walking Dead. Can't highly recommend this enough neither. I think there's 14 volumes in all at the moment. But honest to God, guys, get into this. If you're into zombies or horror movies in general, most of you know about this already, so I don't even know why I'm showing you. But for the guys who don't, definitely get into it. It's I can't highly recommend it enough. Enough said. All right, guys, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to move on to the three horror box sets that I promised to show you at the beginning of the video. I've saved the best till last, I think, and I love these, and I've been waiting and wanting these additions for the longest time. So just bear with us, guys. Nice one. Okay, guys, as you can see, I've picked up the Hellraiser limited edition for this box set. This is the puzzle box edition, and it's a really nice edition, very quirky, you know, and I was very, very happy to finally pick it up. I've been meaning to pick it up for a long time, but there's other things that are on your list before it. And also I have the 4-disc Digipack edition. Uh, but what makes this a bit special is it still has the polystyrene cube inside. You can buy these second hand, but a lot of them don't come with the polystyrene cube. And if you're going to buy this, I recommend waiting and finding one with the cube because you want it to look solid on the shelf. You know, if it's not got the cube in it, it can look quite flimsy. And as you can see, you've got the first three movies plus a bonus disc. And then also you've got your little booklet inside, which just has a bit of info on each movie and what the bonus features are. You can pick this up for about 15, 20 pound, maybe less if you're lucky on the likes of eBay and Amazon. So if you're into your horror, 
and I know a lot of you love the Hellraisers, I know a lot of you have got this already but if you've not got it I highly recommend picking it up but like I said hold out for one with the polystyrene cubing alright guys I'm gonna move on to the next one which is the Phantasm Sphere box set again I've been wanting this for the longest time but I mean I've, I've got a five disc digipack edition with the lenticular cover and I've thought, oh, you know, I'll wait till I find this pr yeah, pretty cheap. And I did find this cheap. I think I found this for £20. You know, it's not perfect. I mean, the box is a bit damaged at the front here. But I can live with that because once I have it displayed, I'll probably have it displayed as the sphere. The sphere, sorry. And as you can see, it's a lovely addition. You would all know this. A lot of you have got it already. And, yeah, it's a really sweet addition. And it comes with the four movies and a bonus disc. What I'll do is I'll open it up and I'll show you it together and what's inside. So just bear with us guys. There you go guys. There it is. As you can see, I have to be careful because I don't want you seeing Buzz's face. <laughs> and it is a lovely addition. As you can see, it just looks like the ball from the movie. And what you do, you see them prongs, they just slot in. And what you can do then is you can just slot the lid off like so. And then within there you've got the five discs and there's like a foam inlay with slits in it and the five discs just slit slit inside, sit inside. And also as well you've got a nice booklet which comes in the box set. Basically again information on each movie and what the special features are and stuff. So yeah, if you're a fan of the, the, um, the Phantasm movies this is the only addition to have okay all right guys what i'll do now is i'm going to move on to the last box set and this is my favorite i've been wanting this one for a long time and i'll stop waffling and i'll just show you so just bear with us all right okay guys there you go that's the last box set it's the hammer collection and this is one that i've been wanting for ages but again it hasn't been on the top of the list but it's gradually moved up there and i found it for a good price as well on a website and yeah i'm really pleased to have it this is the 21 movie 21 disc edition and as you can see it opens up like that and it falls down and you've got a cross on the side with i think that's christopher lee as dracula bit of information on the back and another cross on the other side with a beautiful woman i'm absolutely a massive fan of the hammer movies uh Fantastic in the 60s and 70s. Big part of my childhood growing up. I remember watching them on like a Friday, Saturday night. And like, you get a booklet with it. And the booklet just shows you all of the movies that are in it. A bit of information about the movies, etc. Yada yada. And then you've got some art cards of some of the movies. And there you have Frankenstein Created Woman. Blood of, from the Mummy's Tomb. Quite a mass in the pit. Dracula Prince of Darkness, 1 million years BC and Reptile. Nice little art cards. I love all this kind of quirky stuff. And then as you can see the box set itself, it's in four sections and it's made and it makes up a cross. And I think they're called books, so this will be book one. And we'll go through each one of them. You've got She, the Nanny. Dracula, Prince of Darkness, Plague of the Zombies, Rasputin the Mad Monk. I remember seeing a lot of these as a kid and I remember them terrifying me. They're probably laughable now, but you know, they're classic horror of the 70s, 60s and 70s. And if you're a horror fan like me, you'll definitely love this and I highly recommend it. I'm sure a lot of you guys have got this already, but if you haven't, you can pick it up for about 35 quid, brand new. Second hand, 25, 30. So you've got Reptile, Witches, Million Years BC, The Viking Queen, Frankenstein Created Woman. That's book two. Then we've got book three. And that's got quite a mass in the pit. Vengeance of She, The Devil Rides Out, Prehistoric Woman, Scars of Dracula. Brilliant. Christopher Lee is Dracula. Genius. And then book four, you've got Horror of Frankenstein, Blood from the Mummy's Tomb, Straight 
on till morning, fear in the night, demons of the mind, and to the devil a daughter. I haven't seen quite a few of these, but I remember some of them. So there you go, guys. That is the last horror box set. Nice one. Well, there you go, guys. That is my part two update. Sorry it's a mixed bag of stuff, but I thought you'd like to see it. Um, as always, thank you very much for tuning in and watching, and especially watching the last two videos, because they've been over 15 minutes, and I don't know how you do it, listening to me drone on for so long. Just to let you know though, I will be holding a new competition video and I'll probably be doing it next week. So keep your eyes peeled for the video on that. I'll be giving away some great prizes and yeah, and it's a thank you to all you guys for just all your support over the last year. So thank you very much. Once again, thanks for tuning in. I really do appreciate it. You guys are amazing and I really do appreciate every single one of you. Take care. You're all the best. I'll see you soon.